Good morning, movers, and welcome back to my daily fitness. I'm Tracy Steen. This 30 minute morning mad dash today is gonna focus all on upper body. We're gonna do a strength workout. All right, I'm gonna post another lower body in the 30 minute time frame next week, so these would be great to do together in a week. Grab a variety of dumbbells for the workout. I'm also gonna use my bench, but you can use the floor if you don't have one. I'll start you with a warm up. We'll end with a cool down, and your format for the workout will be 45 seconds of work. 15 seconds in between, hit everything for two rounds, and then move on. All right, are you ready to move daily and build muscle in the upper body? Let's do it. Training on my watch here. Let's warm things up starting with that front and back bend. Very good. Great. A good focus on that upper body. Upper body will definitely feel worked after we're done here today. And like I said, a 30 minute lower body would be great for tomorrow, but I'll put a brand new one out next week. Okay, so look for that. Let's take it wide and right here. Two more here. Good, bring the feet slightly together, hinge at the waist, one arm down, and we'll stretch into those pecs here. Switch. Switch again. And switch. Oh, that's good. Okay, shoulder roll back. And forward. Let's tap it out, reach across and here. Up and over. Little squat in the center. Let's go into a double arm circle here. Switch directions. Good, and squat right here. Swing those arms. Last one here, and take it wide. Open in the chest now. Good, and we'll finish off with a little torso turn. Very good, and there's the first set of exercises. Two rounds of everything, here we go. I'm starting with a single, single double chest press. On your ground or on your bench is fine. Both dumbbells are starting up. I'm holding 15s, single double. So we single, other side single. Now together over the chest and press. Single, single double here.
all right. I'm setting those down, grabbing 12s for my tricep press to shallow overhead extension. Again, you can use the ground. Palms facing the entire time, up, down, then shallow back. So we press it up, come all the way down, reach it long and return. Ceiling, down, shallow overhead, return. Targeting the long head of the tricep on that shallow overhead. All right, elbow, elbow, hand, hand, mod from the knees if you need. Ready and work. So it's elbow, elbow, hand, hand. You can tap and switch lead arms. Getting too challenging, just hold the plank. Okay, and there we go, back up to the top. Fifteens on my single double chest. Get ready. Here we go. And single, single, double now. that shallow tricep. We'll stick with 12s. Alright, palms facing. Give me that tricep press with the shallow extension. And work. Press it up, down, shallow overhead, and return. down to our last up down plank. Remember just two rounds of everything. So that second round is where you want to really challenge the system. Okay. Get ready. Here we go.
12. So that reverse grip, row to bicep curl. Holy 12s. Hinging forward, palms face the ceiling. All right, retract. Pull it up, full stand. Curl it here. Think about squeezing your shoulder blades together on that row. Moving into my one arm row, and I'm gonna grab my 20. Here, I'll call half on the arm. Prop yourself up here if you don't have a bench. Straight up to the ceiling. All right, switch your side and work. Nice, moving to the pinwheel curls and I'll go 15s there. You're crossing in front of the body. All right, these are soft. Palms face the ceiling, alternating sides. Let's work right here, you're up. Good, nice flex at the top. Don't let that wristband keep them locked and neutral here on the curl. Very good. All right, one arm row, sticking with the 20. I'll call half, nice flat back here, and work. Last one here, switch your arm.
And finishing off with those pinwheel curls. 15s for me. All right, crossing in front, shoulders back. Remember my tip about not allowing the dumbbell to slip into your fingertips when you're holding heavy weights? Hold it in the meaty part of your hand to help prevent tendon exacerbation in the elbow. Flex at the top. Great. Set those down, moving into shoulders. I'll start with the 12s for that single double Arnold press. All right, you'll do right side, left side, and then both together. Knees are soft, starting here. So you're here. Other side single here, now both. Eyes are straight ahead, don't look at the weights. I'm gonna keep that 12 for my single side reverse fly. If you don't have a bench, you can just again prop yourself up on your leg and we'll hit that reverse fly with a nice rounded arm. All right, back is flat and I'll call half. Good, retract your shoulder blade up. Last one here, switch arms. Okay, now we're moving into a palms up cross body raise, okay? We're gonna do single side. I'll hold tens. This is a little chest, a little front shoulder. Palms face the ceiling. And cross right here. Elbow is soft. Cross right there. Now, no swinging the dumbbell at the bottom. Start from a dead stop. And stick your chest out. Boom. Good. Go back to the Arnold's. See those tens there. Holding 12s again. Single, single, double Arnold. You could sit if you'd like. Let's work. Single, single, double now.
burn. All right, I uh, will use a 12 for my single side reverse fly. I'll call half, rounded arm, and retract. Again, dead stop at the bottom, no swinging. Switch your side. Nice. Okay, I'm getting a good 10 in there. Back to my 10s for the, actually, I think I'll use 12s. Only one more round, may as well. Cross body raise. Here we go. Here, here. Oh, that's heavier. <laughs> like that's work. Wait a minute. Moving to my 20s for that wide, narrow press. 120 is there, 120 is there. All right, on your back or on the ground, wide, turn narrow at the top. Start wide and turn and press. Come back wide, turn and press over the chest. Grabbing my 12s for that Tate press. All right, Tate press is here. You're coming down to the chest, pressing and flexing at the top. On your back. I don't have an answer for that. Is there something else I can help with? You're here. Of course, Siri's talking to me in the middle of it all. here in this um, plie skull crusher just to not put so much volume on the triceps here we go everything is down everything is up and flex low flex at the top
Okay, wide narrow press with my 20s. feeling this. We're all ready. Here we go. Wide turn narrow. Torso facing me, stick your chest out.
good. Finishing with that crushed complex. I think I'll stick with eights right now. We'll do a curl press and then into that overhead tricep extension there. So it's gonna be whatever you can tricep extension. Curl it here. Press, triceps, elbows in. Nice. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, round two, last one. I think I'll go into my 15s for this whole complex. Again, it's gonna be whatever you can high pull or hammer curl here. Hinge at the waist, row right here. We row, high pull, hammer here. Elbows in. Moving into your front lateral combo. I, I'm gonna pick 10. No, yeah, 10s. <laughs> yes, no, yes, no. We'll try it, nice and slow. Stick your chest out, keep good form. Good, heavy at the end. I'll stick with tens for this last exercise. I'll try that crush complex now with tens. It'll be hard on the triceps, but I will give it a go. Last exercise, knees are soft. Let's curl, press, triceps up and down. Last three, two, one and done. You move daily in your upper body morning mad dash. That was great. All of those upper body muscles have been targeted. Join for a stretch now if you can. Let's stay standing for a stretch and find a wall or maybe the back of your bench if it's inclined. Uh, chair, we're gonna stretch that pec muscle here. This is an important one to stretch throughout the day. We're all on computers and phones these days. Some of us for eight hours a day or more with our jobs. Switch sides. So what's happening is with the arms forward, we're shortening that pec muscle. Oh, I am definitely noticed like my body shifting from my computer work and it bugs me. I don't want it to happen. So I know that I'm gonna try to do this this year like very diligently. Every time I walk through a door frame, stretch open those pec muscles there. Let's round through the back here. 
Yeah, I just don't, I don't do it often enough just to lengthen because that is one area that is shortening again through our phone usage and from computer work. So people 50 years ago didn't have that issue, even 30 years ago, right? We didn't have phones that we were on constantly or computers that we were working from constantly. So it makes a big difference. Like even this feels tight. You don't like it, but that's why we stretch. Hinge forward, reach, push that thumb to the ceiling, give that wrist a roll. All of my arm, I feel very like everything was worked in the upper body, it was good. We didn't do any abs, technically those are part of the upper body as well, but I'll often throw those in with legs, which I'll probably do next week with the 30 minute uh, lower body workout. Okay, so check that out, stay tuned for that. Let's go into a tricep stretch here. <sighs> My muscles feel actually quite hot right now too. I get time for any photos though because everything feels very pumped, I'll give it that. Switch sides. Mm, good, good. All right folks, short stretch today, but thanks for joining. Go move daily now in your wellness and nutrition. There's a workout for tomorrow if you can't wait till next week for the lower body. See ya next week or tomorrow or whenever, bye.